What's up, Peak Freaks? We are ready. Are you ready for the workout cardio session Friday? Yes. Let's do this. Like the old times of Peak, huh? Yes. What you need for today, let's start with the warm up right here foam roller, and I have the stretch strap. But if you do not have them, I will show you some exercises as well to do the warm up. So if you do have a foam roller, just start with foam rolling. We need to do this, guys. I am super sore. If you've been doing the exercises with us, if you've been following along, you are going to be sore as well. So very important preparation before the workout. So we are doing the foam rolling, the stretching, never hopping into the workout, just like cold turkey. I've seen this so many times. People go into the gyms, just start lifting immediately instead of letting their blood flow, letting really starting and warming up. Hello, Peak Free Kids. Let's do this. Just watch the step over there. Come on, come over here. Bomb roll with me or Ticey start doing body weight exercises, whatever you want. So for those of you who do not have the foam roller, I want you to just do reach down towards the floor, stand up straight, open up your chest, and then alternating toe touches. That's gonna be your sequence right here, okay? So reach down towards the floor, open up your chest, alternating toe touches. We are foam rolling. Ivanka, are you gonna be foam rolling with us? Or what are you gonna be doing? All right, feels good right here. Let's do this, guys. Now we're gonna go sides. If your foam roller is super hard, has the spikes, and you're just starting, you can bring the top leg over. So you uh, take a little bit the, the toughness of the ro roller away from you, because otherwise you, you're putting all your body weight over it, so it's gonna be super hard. Now I'm going right into the hamstrings, and remember, you guys are doing the other stuff, exactly what we showed you. Okay, let's do this. Hammies, hammies right here. My hamstrings are super tight. And we're gonna do the other side. This is going to be a 60 minute cardio session. 60 minutes. So foam roll with us. Let's get you ready. Yes. Back is straight. Shoulder to shoulder, straight line. Let's not forget about the inner ties. Inner ties play such an important role. What's inner ties? Right here. Inner thighs. Yes, yes, inner thighs. She wants me to, to, to say it. The, I, the, I, the, the always, thing I always thought inner thighs was a different thing than inner thighs. Because you always say inner thighs. It's and inner. <laughs> Elbow down, close towards the ankle, 
take that right hand down, right leg. Let's open up the left arm. Listen, this is not a yoga. This is just a stretch. Step back, left leg. Hold it here for a second. Left elbow down, slowly. Right arm up. And bring it back. Legs are wide. Now, as you crawl and your heels are touching the ground, look, that's the moment you want, right there. Touch the, touch the toes and come up. You're gonna do it one more time. And I guarantee you, when you're gonna actually repeat that, you're gonna feel, whoa, my body is actually elongating, you're becoming longer, yes. Because we are stretching, because we were tight before, right? Yes, let's do this, scroll out, legs straight, high plank, the compression right here. Flip those toes, boom, down. Look up, heels, hips are down. Avanga, we are working out. What are you doing? Come on, join us. It's gonna be a fun workout, guys. Fun, fun, fun. High plank, right leg. Now look, elbow, elbow, oh yeah, deeper. Left arm, bring it down. Now look, drop that left knee, guys. Hip flexors right here, push forward, good. Hands down, left leg up, step back, left leg, boom, slow. You see that range of motion is being increased. Left elbow, you ready? We already did that? Hold on, this is a sequence. Ah. Woo! I slapped you here, buddy, I'm sorry. <laughs> right leg down, hips forward, push it. There you go, just gently still. All right, step back, crawl your hands. Touch your toes, legs straight. Now look, I am right here now. I can touch the floor. Before I felt Steph was with us. Thank you guys for rolling in here. <laughs> Harry, I, I know we get those phone calls. Uh, we get those phone calls and messages all the time. People are asking me, we're gonna open Peak Physique again in New York. We want, however, there is a different level of coaching right now. So we are doing mind and body and business coaching right now that you guys have to follow along workouts on the application. The application has been released two months ago. You have your workouts, you have your motivation, you have your videos in there. And then here and there, you can jump in for the live workouts like today's surprise workout. And once a month, you guys have a 90 minutes of coaching session with us, which will help you in all these different areas. People have boosted their businesses and, and their life in general, general by following along. So let's do this. All right, guys, we are starting. So that's the story right now. And, and for those of you who will accommodate, not only you're gonna look great because these workouts work, it doesn't matter where you are. We showed you this before, then you can get in shape in an elevator. You don't need a lot of space. What you need is just a couple of equipment, like some dumbbells and medicine ball. You know, a lot of you've been accumulating this over the course of the few months that we've been, the whole country been on, the, the whole world been on the shutdown. So we've been practicing and training and coaching all the time, never stop. And that's how you got to live your life. You got to just uh, move forward and accommodate and, and don't waste your time in commercial gyms. Yes, so you can take these workouts anywhere. If you want to go to commercial gym, take your phone with you, follow the workout at home. All right, let's not. Put this away, medicine balls, dumbbells, because it's cardio, nobody's lifting heavy today. This has to be fast paced, okay? So, Tyson dumbbells, I'm gonna start with, I'm gonna start literally with 10. If I wanna increase, I will, I will let you know. Uh, I'm gonna start with 10. This is a fast pace. We are starting right now. Medicine balls have to be to the side, but somewhere to the side that you can quickly grab it. Don't go. Okay, we're starting. Okay, Ivanka, let's go. Get your medicine ball. Tracy, where is yours? Need a sec. Okay, let's do this. This one is eight. Get this one. Me? This I'm one is 20. Oh, you didn't know. Minge. I'm still missing a medicine ball somehow. Uh, uh, That's a basketball. Uh, it is? Yes, this one will. Oh. Okay, so. Minge, here. Medicine ball to the side. It's three pounds. Dumbbells 
and we're gonna be switching quick. So get ready and then so we have dumbbells, medicine ball, body weight. That's how it goes. We're gonna we we're adding all the nice. exercise each time, so you better pay attention. Try not to get a bouncy ball, it's gonna uh, bounce in your face, but if you don't have anything else, you gotta just work with it. Alright, so we're gonna start with squat thrust with dumbbells and a push-up. Preparation time is five seconds. Let's do this, guys. I'm just gonna make sure that everybody can hear this sound. Mid, we're starting. I'm coming. Stop. Doubles to the side. Let's do this. Squat down. Jump out. Push up. Jump back in. Back is straight. Lift those dumbbells up. Squat. Jump out. Push up. Jump back in. Back straight. Stand up straight. Again. Out in. Full push up. Strong abs, strong quads, strong legs in general. Go all the way down with that push up. Some of you have to elevate maybe on a couch. Do it. Catch is too high. That's the whole point for some people. All right. All right, dumbbells to the side. Medicine ball. Medicine ball toss, go. Toss it, now stop. This is, so you're going pretty fast in place. Ivanka, stay in place, don't jump. From the chest, toss that ball. Mine is great for a warm up, but later I have to get a leg up here, one. Straight from the chest, guys, straight from the chest. Push that ball. You're not getting it. If you have like that big X ball, Fine. I don't know. Toss a pillow. Something. Toss something. But Find something. Our way. So I know, but don't get any muscle. Toss your kid. They have to just toss something there. Toss okay? your kid. Listen up. Low plank right now. Low plank. Toss a stick full dispenser. Okay. Stay in the low plank position. Elbows down on the floor. No, I cannot do five high five high five. Stop. High five. Right Stop. here. Right here. Uh, hands are separated, guys. So the whole goal is look, elbow, pinky is down onto the ground. Stop praying. Thumb is facing the Big. ceiling, Stop. feet together. Elbows directly Under. underneath uh, underneath your shoulders, please, okay? So make sure you have that line here. Bitch. Stay here, stay here. Get up. We're doing squat thrust quickly on your Ivanka, Ivanka. Go, 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 go. Squat thrust. Push up. And a curl right here. We are in that bicep curl. Really hung our breath. Back straight. At that curl. So come back. All the way down, push up. Do it elevated on a couch if you have to. If you cannot go fully squat thrust or walk your feet one at a time. Boom, right here. <laughs> now look, medicine ball that goes to the side. We're gonna be doing That's a basketball. squat and toss. This is fast tempo, go. Boom, look, non-stop. The ball goes down, you're going right into the squat. You're not waiting, tossing, waiting, and then squatting. It's bam, bam, elbows touching those knees. Back is straight, common mistake is this. Keep your chest open, guys. Stay on your heels. Activate those quads. Glutes, hamstrings, push. We are feeling this in our obviously heart rate. Keep those shoulder blades down, back, important. Plank walk. We're gonna go right into a plank walk. Feel this from yesterday from <coughs> swimming and going crazy in the pool. In my shoulder. Okay, so look. Low plank right here. Left arm, boom. Right arm, boom. Now we're going 
slow down, switch the arms. Now your hand has to go in place of your elbow. Some of you will try to do a plank one and push it and stand and stand up. No, you gotta move that hand. That's the goal, okay? Pinky down, palm is up. Try not to wobble. Stiff, stiff and straight. Take your time. Stiff, body. Ah. Good. Back to your squat thrust. We ending a squat jump at the end. Let's go. Shoulders back, chest is up. Go, go, go. Push up. All the way down. Look. Curl right here from the crawl. Boom. Squat. And again. Unfold. Jump. Feet together. Low push up. Right here. Yes. Just. Yes, I see. You don't need to do a jump. For some of you who cannot do a jump, you're going to do a regular squat, please. If you know that your body cannot take myometric, it's fine. Ah. Dumbbells down. Nice and ball. We're jumping. And we toss it. Look. Jump. Toss. Jump. Toss. Let's go, my friends. Let's have fun. Ivanka, what happened with you? Where are you? What are you doing over there? You're supposed to be here, tossing that ball. Jump. Boom. Now, how are you jumping? You're landing on the ball of your feet and quickly shifting that weight towards your heels. All right, but you gotta jump and stay on the bent legs. All right, plank walk. Now we're gonna add the shoulder chop. You ready, guys? Let's do this, guys. So we starting low. We're going high. We're doing shoulder chop, shoulder chop. Then you're gonna do the other side. So left side, push. Starting with your left arm, right arm. You go down on your right. You come up on your right. You do right and then left shoulder tap. Then you go slowly down. I want a good technique here. Dig those abs, squeeze your quads. Tight, tight and strong. Awesome job. I want this to be repeated one more time this final sequence let's go i got a heavier one a little heavier 15 pounds right now if you have a lower back problem don't increase that weight because it's a deadlift right here when you lifting those weights Now, make sure that 
you coming actually going up and going down because some of you will leave those hips behind on the low plank you're gonna be up here and looking at your toes no you're looking straight down onto the ground right here time active stretch right here active stretch this is of quad stretches breathing taking a deep breath in through your nose exhaling through your lips you can do this in a lying down position sideways even right here bottom leg bend bring that heel into the glute alternate your sides this is a lot of flexion spinal flexion here squat thrust and all bring your knees towards the chest extend one leg at a time bring your arms overhead see how those shoulder blades fall into place Deep breath in through your nose. Exhale through your lips. Repeat with me those exercises. All right. Woo. The heat is blasting. All right. My left shoulder feels it. I have to totally stretch your shoulders. Come across the, against the wall something equipment bring your hands behind you open up that chest loosen up and talk if it pops all right I think my lower back problem will be fixed <laughs> you are moving crazy stuff Tyson mm -hmm. all right guys adjust your weight if you have to I am going to take a bigger ball <sighs> Even though I like the small one, but I need a little bit heavier, so I'm just gonna be dealing with some stuff here. Oh, that the daddy took the daddy took the medicine balls for the operation. Operation black side in Los Angeles right now happening. So make sure you're checking Steve that Eckert one stories because it's super cool stuff. All right, dumbbell crawl up. Are we ready? Are we ready? We are starting. How are you guys? How are you? We are going, who is going with us? Thumbs up or something. Show me a sign of life. We gotta start alive here. All right. Crawl out. This is speed. It has nothing to do with heavy lifting today. We crawling out. In a crawl out, your feet have to be wider. They must. Please do not do this. Dumbbells will be in the center. And that's how you're gonna crawl out to a high plank position. You're gonna perform all the way down push up. Not on your knees. Not like this. This will never get you to any push up. All right. You can do it. I want to either lay down on the floor, remove your hands from the dumbbells, go all the way down on the floor, push yourself off the floor. Then get your dumbbells or just do body weight. If you are new to this and you have no, you, you, you pretty much cannot perform anything, okay? So there is always a way, but if you limit yourself immediately from just looking at this exercise, you are doomed. Then you will never do anything, all right? So no dumbbells, just body weight. Hello, Liz. You better work out with us. If not, I'm gonna drag you here. To this location right here into this garage you're gonna be doing life with me you better tell me that you guys are doing some workout all right so chop chop are we ready let's go i'm turning on the clock body weight or dumbbells it's your choice i don't know where you are but you gotta do it crawl out crawl out we gotta hit that push up if you don't have the dumbbells, do a body weight. Guys, do a body weight. But don't let something that you don't have stop you from doing the exercises. Because this is a common thing, common mistake. People do it all the time. I don't have this. Or I cannot do this. Just stop with these excuses. Get your body moving. Once you're going to start doing moving your body, a week from now, you're going to be doing amazing things that you didn't even think that you can do. And of course, share this video with someone. Share on your friends page. Ask them, talk them right now to join us. Look, Tyson is done with the one class. 
school here in California. Woo! Some schools, whatever you are, might not be done yet. But this will be perfect for you and your family to do a workout together. school 
I schedule my own calendar. I schedule my own coaching clients and whatever time. This time was not available. No calls, no text, no nothing. Yeah. Oh, where's my ball? Whoa! We got it at the jump. Look, look, look. Catch that ball. Jump. Right. Slam it. Jump.
Tyson is stretching. Are you stretching? No. All right. I'm just laying on the ground. Joker. He's such a joker. He is such a joker. All right. Sip your pre-workout. What's in your concoction? What's in your concoction? A little different, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. Stretch. Now, maybe, maybe your hamstrings are got, got tight. Reach down towards the floor. Look, this. And I loosen up the shoulders. Tap your toes. Bring your hands down. Hold that position. Your body is so warm. It feels so good. It's like it's totally stretched out right now. Feels super good. And and we're gonna get into the the sit up. So some of you have been asking me, is this is this like a sign to lit up? Yes. One of our coaches, the laundry, the laundry gave us this sign for the second location. That's why it's still the number on it from the second location of uh, Peak Physique, but this sign can be lit up. But right now we have it as a setup, so you guys have a nice background to remind you of peak, but now it's all about peak performance, coaching, mind, body, business, taking it to the next level because workouts alone are, on, are not enough. People need coaching, people need, because if your mind's mindset go down, you will not do a workout. You won't. So, we gotta train you, get you more resilient, stronger with that killer attitude, right? Yes. All right, killer attitude, I'm talking about killing, approaching the goals, not doing other things, all right? Let's not, <laughs> let's not go there. We're talking about kill the hill, have an awesome, amazing attitude because this is your time on this planet right now, on this planet Earth, this is your time, guys. This is the life that you have. You gotta take charge of it. You gotta take your life in your own hands, all right? And, and you are the creator of your movie. You are the creator of your book. You are the creator of your life. Sit out, my friend. Kami, kami. Kami, kami. All right, sit out. Sit outs are tricky. They are fun. But a lot of you to not how to do that, right? So we're gonna lift left arm, right leg goes under, and you're gonna do a sit up like this, putting it through. Ah, oh, the shoulder, I don't like that. Ah, did we start? So, no, I just showed them. Now, if you're new to this, you're gonna be doing a body weight sit up. Body weight sit up without any dumbbells. If you have ability to do the, what we're doing, you're gonna do the sit out with the dumbbells. Now, some of you cannot do even a sit out. What you can do is a hold a plank position. What I want you to do is just do a knee tuck, a cross, that's it. Or the other version is to try to sit on that glute, right glute, and then left glute, okay? You're gonna get there, you just need to practice. All right, my friends, let's do this. Spicy, if your shoulder's not feeling it, don't do it. All right. In 10 seconds, we are starting, guys. We're not pressing. Please, let's go. Excuse me, Tyson. Excuse me. Let's go. My friends, I'm lifting that dumbbell. I'm bringing this dumbbell right into my shoulder. I can sit on that glute if I want to. Of course, if I'm above the floor, holding that dumbbell right here, this is much heavier, much harder. It seems like I will have to stay on the same side because the other side is really bothering me. So I am not taking a chance to get injured. So I'm just gonna do the same thing on the same side. You guys will alternate the sides. All right, medicine ball, jack press. If you do not have a ball, you can do 
this with the dumbbell, holding the dumbbell in both hands, doing regular jack presses right here. Abs are tight, glutes are tight, bring that ball towards your chest and push it back up. Now for some of you, you need to modify and keep on stepping, just like this, totally fine. Do not stop, there is an always a way. Some of you will jump and press and jump in the center, whatever helps you to get through this. High plank, just holding. Now, so many of you have been doing the high plank in the wrong way. Hands underneath the shoulders. Guys, hands underneath the shoulders. The back is straight. The back is straight. Feet are together. You're staying on the ball of your feet. And I'm going to show you sideways. Look, I am not here. I am not here. I am here. Stiff as a board. Stiff, strong. Squeeze everything. Squeeze your glutes, your inner thighs, your abs, pull them together. And then you tell me that this is an easy exercise. It's not easy if you not if you're gonna make it not easy. Okay? Do it correctly and it's gonna be challenging. Sit out. Now we would add guys a press. Let's go. So that would be a press right here. And then I'm going to show you one time a press from the other side. Now, if you want to sit on that floor right here and do a press, be my guest. You can do this too. Just watch that shoulder because you are off right now. You're sitting on the floor. Then that push comes and that's the shoulder is super challenged right here. So please be careful with the shoulders here. stopping on zero. Sit out. Lateral now. So look, first we're gonna move laterally. Then we're gonna do a sit out and a press. Sit out and a press. Then you're gonna move to the other side. You ready? In a high plank position. That's how you're gonna go. dumbbells and that's okay if you can only move these dumbbells in a high plank position it's still awesome just do what you can guys but it's just really trying really trying front and back let's go front and back jack press up come on let's see put your shoes 
Watch out! All right. I'm looking at my nose shoes. I'm strong. Hi guys. I see. Whoa, be careful. Some of you just joined. Hello, hello, peeps. Oh my god. Ivanka will laugh. The last <laughs> time he did some I want to mm. Wave, 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 wave. Ivanka wave. loves to wave, wave. So she will wave to all of you. She's my a waving wave. assistant. Wave. Waving assistant, please wave, wave. to everybody. Wave. Please, wave. please. Don't do it. Then Scroll I'll down your list on some people. All right. No, I Guys. wave to everybody. Listen. I wave to everybody. Listen, listen up. You are doing flatter kicks. I wave to all the people. We go down time, flatter kicks with dumbbells. I so we're gonna be the pumping the legs. Stop playing with that person. And simultaneously be, going with the dumbbells at the same time. You're gonna be moved from this premises so, by a person. Oh. Good sweat, good sweat. Thank Who's you. sweaty? Who's sweaty? Did Thank you work out? You. I'm sure you did. All right. Let's go. Flatter kicks. Chop, chop, choppy, choppy, chop, chop. Choppy, choppy, chop, chop. Flatter kicks your favorite. Flatter kicks your favorite. Missy, Vanka, Vanka. Flatter kicks and and the dumbbell, Stacy. Cool. Come on, let's go, buddy. Come on. You, you can, okay, I will hit the clock. You guys get ready. Look, lower back has to be flat. You're gonna be doing flatter kicks with both dumbbells and legs going alternating, right? Now, for some of you that cannot synchronize this, get one dumbbell here. I trust me on this one. It's gonna be much easier for you to do one dumbbell and both arms and then the legs, okay? Now, lower back has to be pressed against the floor. You cannot have an opening on that lower back. So don't arch that back, okay? I want you to flatten it, strong shoulders, pop those arms and pop those legs and the peak freaks are going. Three, two, two one. one. Lower back is pressed against the floor, everybody. Flutter kicks. Flutter kicks. Flutter kicks now. Look, look at me. 
We're gonna add something. Hold on, because I didn't tell you guys. Listen, this is. You might want it to have a lighter dumbbell. And watch this. Look. We're doing one, two, three, four, and you're gonna get up. You're gonna get up with these dumbbells, and then you're gonna go down. So that leg goes boom down. Roll yourself down. Do whatever it takes. You're not gonna be training how to get up. You're gonna go one, two, three, four. The whole point is to shift that weight to a seated position. Shift that weight right here. Get up with those dumbbells. Alternate those legs and let's go. You guys got it. Don't do a heavy weight. Ivanka, you can do it without the weight. Watch yourself, please. Step away from each other. Pay attention to what I tell you each time, okay? I'm really good at getting up with them at hands. Step away from Tyson, okay? A little bit more over there. There you go. Watch because you have a dumbbell next to you, Ivanka. Put that dumbbell away. So when you go down, it's not gonna hit your uh, face, uh, face, your head. Voila. Ah, tons of core, guys. Woo. You're gonna get hurt. Ivanka, this is not a joke. All right, guys, medicine ball. We're going right into squat and press out. So look, power squat. You're gonna be power squatting and pushing, pushing right here. You're gonna stay right here, okay? And pushing that ball out, okay, got it? So look, right here, back is straight. So look, boom, boom. Push that, push that ball out. Push it out. One squat, one push. motion like we did with the jacks but just now woo, ah, we're pushing the ball out as we squatting skateboard to press. I know! It's fun, right? Animal sit, alternate. 
alternating leg lifts. This is it. <laughs> Sit. Look. Leg lift. Leg lift. Go. I didn't wave to them. All right. Boom. Now, a moment of silence. <sighs> Lay down. Diamond position with your legs. Everybody, Tyson, this is good for you. So, come on, everybody, let's go. Why don't you stretch with this? Hmm? And extend that way. And press it. Oh, feels good. Oh, feels good, but it's really tight, Tyson. Is your tight too, like hip flexors? much better to do that. So now we're going to take left hand and right, left hand over the right knee. <clears throat> okay, something popped on the screen. We are almost done, guys. Right now we're just doing this stretching. So what I want, look guys, take look. this side. Left hand, right knee. You're going to bring that right leg onto the left side of your body but what I want is that shoulder. I think I can move honey a little bit. I need to extend my arm over Ticey. <laughs> and tickle tickle tickle. All right so if your hand is down on the, on the floor, if your finger is touching the floor, you actually stretching your arm right here but only when when that leg is across. Oh, it feels so good. Now, we're gonna go slowly. Right hand, left knee, head, head, left hand down on the floor. Oh, oh this shoulder, oh, it feels good. Now, some of you cannot bring that leg so far. Oh, it feels so uncomfortable. Put a pillow underneath that knee, please, or the stability pad, and it will help you, okay? 
because it might really feel so uncomfortable for you, so don't force it. We are not done. We need to do a lot of different stretches because we've been really, really working hard and tomorrow is going to be another hardcore session. Bring that heel into the glute. Tomorrow we're going to take it on later. That's what we do it tomorrow. Most likely. And switch. And switch the other leg. Some bottle ropes tomorrow. Bring your heel into the glute. And roll up. Now listen, look, straddle position is good. Like this. Feet are wide. Bring yourself center. Bring your right arm up and over to your left leg, left toe. Mm -hmm. The other hand has to be centered. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now bring your arms up. The right hand, left quad, left arm, up and over. for uh, adults and kids yoga classes together please send me a message we would love to join your parents and kids workout sessions we wanted to do it together ah. oh yeah diamond position now ah, we're gonna go right into the hip flexor let's come on Tracy let's bring oh this is again I don't know what this is from the floor? Yeah. <laughs> Left leg forward. Right leg is behind me. Roll yourself out. Go all the way down. This is good. Stretch. Go, 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 buddy. Sink into the floor. I am. I totally relax. Good. Now we're gonna switch. We're gonna go right leg. Ah, right leg down, 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 down. Now look, sink into the floor, like literally letting it go, letting go, let it go. Rag go. Rag go, position. Okay, now look, right here, we're going to walk our, first, we're going to push those hips up, heels are down, stretch those calves, now walk your hands straight, look how far we have gotten, I can place my whole hands down flat on the floor, guys, when we started, I was somewhere here, look how your body <laughs> along it, it got hot, it got stretched out, you feel amazing, the, the energy that you have right now, it's absolutely not comparable to anything. You will not get that energy from no products, okay? This energy, you are like the plant, so remember, you release the energy, you are the generator, you are, you have to create the energy. Not relying on uh, outside sources, really, it's within you. You carry the energy and you need to do this. So use your body in the right way. Eat the right food to give you a good energy so you can perform at your best and not being dragged throughout the day and sluggish and slow and not feeling good. And what you want to do is sit on the couch. You can do this. Anyone can do this. If we can do it, you can do it too. Remember this. But they are choices, always the choices that you make. So, 
Today I challenge you to do something better for yourself this weekend as far as your fitness and your nutrition, that's number one. And personal development, number two, goes really as priority the same. So find a book. You don't know the good book. I will tell you a good book to read, Napoleon Hill, Think and Grow Rich today, by to yesterday when I went to ship something into FedEx, uh, I went to FedEx. Can you imagine that the only book that they had was Think and Grow Rich on the shelf? I was surprised because this book, a lot of people did not hear about it, but the influencers, people in the business that we meet, we connect, they know this book and it's a fantastic book. So this book can change your life if you're going to really implement a lot of things. So personal development goes hand in hand with your nutrition, your, your fitness. It has to. So let's do this. And if you need help with anything, please send us a message because we are here to help you and guide you and lead you. And of course, don't forget that every Wednesday I go live with the No Excuses Ladies Show. You can sign up to my YouTube channel with clicking on the link. I'm going to attach the link to the Facebook on the Instagram. You can just click to any of the No Excuses videos and short clips and sign yourself up. You're going to find a lot of videos there now. Uh, for the Peak Physique and Why, sign up on our YouTube channel because there is a lot of different uh, different videos of the workouts and you can get that as well. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining us today. It was a pleasure. Tyson, Ivanka, go guys. Say something fun to everybody. No! The whole entire neighborhood have been <laughs> have been on their toes right now. All right, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.